Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are talking about the 10 commandments of furniture placement. So let's start the video. The function over form. The most important factor when arranging any room is to understand and how the layout reflect. How the space will be used and for example, two sofas placing each other are Presently symmetrical, but if your prim primary activity when sitting on said sofa is watching the TV, not ideal. Think about what you would like to do in the space. What needs to be within arms each and how much room you will need. You can create a floor plan that flows. And the second idea is always allow for flow. An empty room is the best kind of blank slate for interior design junkies. But once you get furniture in there and start to arrange it, what seems like a lot of opportunity can suddenly feel oppressive. Map your traffic route. Remember that less is more and stick to at least 3 feet of walking room between pieces. Balance is key. When you are into symmetry in design or not, balance is important in any space. Visually, contract a large piece of furniture with two smaller ones. Or a tall floor lamp with a hanging pendant. Get color and pattern in on the balance game and you'll be Feeling zen in no time. Every seat gets a body. There is something oddly lonely about a cozy armchair or love seat just hanging out by itself. What is one going to do there? See the first point. Wherever you have somewhere comfortable to sit, make sure there is also a surface on which to rest a cup of tea, a light to read by, a dad, every least a buddy chair to, two people can sit and chat together, Crease, create zones. In an open plan space, you can use your furniture agreement to create cozy room and designate areas for specific use. A rug under a group of chair make a conversation zone and eye-catching candy layer over a table makes a dining area and simply turning a sofa with its back to rest of room says that is a living room. And then create a zones in an open plain space you can use your furniture agreement arrangement to create cozy room and designate areas for specific use. A rug under a group of chair makes a conversation zone and eye-catching candelier over a table. Makes a dining area and simply turning a sofa. With its back to the rest of room says this is a living room. Don't be a wall floor. We have been saying this one long enough that it shouldn't come as a surprise. Expect in smallest of room with anticipation of dance party. There is no need to push all your furniture up against the wall. Even giving a sofa 12 inches of breathing room can create the illusion of a larger airer space. Thank you so much guys for watching, keep watching, keep supporting and must subscribe my YouTube channel.